Now, the word curling first appeared in 1620 when found in a preface and verses of a poem by Henry Adamson. I don't have the poem. Okay. I I was about to be excited. (laughs) I have a a different poem, but increasing evidence occurred. References to the game appeared with increasing frequency. It's possible to say that by the end of the 18th century, curling was played throughout the lowlands of Scotland. Uh Poets of a name I cannot even begin to pronounce, but I will spell it for you. Kirkabrightshire. It's (laughs) K-I-R-K-C-U. No, don't spell it. Keep going. (laughs) Renfrewshire and Lanarkshire. The Narkshire. That guy was an asshole. Holy <laughs> complaining to the cops. All celebrated the game and published poems. Although no evidence has been found that Robert Burns was a curler, he certainly knew all about it, as the two stanzas from Tam Sampson's Elegy clearly demonstrate. And these are how they go. Okay. When winter muffles up its... <clears throat> when winter... <laughs> Do you want me to try? <laughs> you okay? <laughs> When mi- <laughs> I'm, I I <laughs> this is real, everybody. This is very real. <laughs> when winter muffles up his cloak, okay, and binds the mire like a rock. When to the lows the curlers flock, we gleesome speed. Why will they station at the cock? Tam Samson's dead. <laughs> Question mark? <laughs> he was <laughs> <laughs> He was the king of <laughs> <laughs> why, is this, why is this so funny? <laughs> I gotta finish this bone, man! No, oh, just finish it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a whole other stanza. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go ahead. <clears throat> go ahead. Go ahead. You got this. You got it. You got. Oh no, he's gone purple. Come on, <laughs> pull it together. <laughs> pull it together. I can't read. Oh, he's really gone. Yeah, I can't read it for you. Come down. Oh wow, we will. Come on, go, go. All right. <clears throat> <sighs> he was the king. <laughs> <laughs> He was the king. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay, 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 okay. It's fine. <laughs> Who knew that the world's funniest poem was here in Scotland all along? He was the king of Ah the Core to guard or draw or wick a boar or up the rink like Genu Sor in time o' need. But now he lags on death's hog score. Tam Sampson's dead. Oh, God. So it wasn't funny at all. <laughs> it, was, it, was a, it was a eulogy. <laughs> we were laughing at a eulogy. <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> Jesus, I'm so sorry. <laughs> really, someone out there that was their favorite poem, and it meant so much to them. It helped them get over like something very sad. And here we are laughing our asses off of it, but very beautiful, very beautiful. Uh, uh, anyway, continue. Do I try and read it again without the? No, <laughs> <laughs> we gotta move on. All right. <laughs>